Growing up in Georgia, severe storms happened all the time and tornadoes quickly became one of my biggest fears. I was that kid cowering in the basement, listening to the weather on the radio with a death grip on my mom's hand. But by learning more about what to watch out for and how to stay safe, this fear actually transformed into my love and appreciation for weather. So let's talk about some severe weather safety tips that will hopefully calm some of those fears for you too. First, know your forecast and have a plan. The safest place in your house is your basement, or if you don't have a basement, an interior room on your lowest floor, avoiding any windows if possible. A helmet, heavy blankets, coats, or even a mattress can protect you from flying debris. And don't forget a sturdy pair of shoes for navigating possible damage afterwards. If you're caught on the road with no shelter close by, park your car away from any overpasses. If you can safely get to noticeably lower ground, like a ditch, you'll want to get out, lie down flat, and cover your head with your hands. But if not, stay in your car with your head covered below the windows. To avoid being in that situation in the first place, it's important to be alert on the day severe storms are expected. So let's talk watches versus warnings. Tornado watches are issued when the ingredients are in place, meaning they are possible and you should be prepared to act. But a warning is when the ingredients have come together and a tornado is developing, and you should seek shelter immediately. But in order to react, you need to get the alerts first. Whether it's a NOAA weather radio or your smartphone, you'll want to make sure that they're set up to properly alert you. These notifications could save your life, especially at night. I hope knowing how to prepare and what to look out for helps you feel more confident this severe weather season.